Hello, just want to do a couple of quick videos to get us ready and get us started and get us prepared for doing this Ultra Extension Framework tutorial. So what we're looking at now is one of the prerequisites. This is called ngrok, N-G-R-O-K dot com. And basically what ngrok does is it allows you to run applications from your desktop that need to be accessible by the outside world. And so what this really allows us to do is it allows us to build and test LTI REST Ultra Extension Framework applications from our desktop. Ingrok, with the simple command, basically tunnels its way from your desktop out into a publicly accessible IP address. Um, and so it is, a, it is a perfect tool for what we're trying to do. And so what we're looking at now is our Ingrok homepage and so basically what we need to do is go ahead and install it so if we click on download you should get this screen and you should have your default application uh, there's a number of ways that you can install it but the easiest is just to download it for Mac OS it will download a zip file and then you can um, you can extract it in the directory that you want to use it uh, for me I I installed it in a path that is accessible on my on my path in my terminal and this allows me to run it from anywhere uh, many people install it in the same directory that they actually plan to run it and then you can you can run it locally uh, but for me I, I'm testing a lot of different things so I have it running in a place where I can uh, I can access it on the path and I can just type in Grok and I'm off and running so once you download uh, download your ngrok for your particular operating system and you install it. Um, the important part is that you are able to access it. So let's take a look at ngrok. And so this is currently running, so let me go ahead and stop this. And so for our purposes, we're going to be using port 5000, so it's as simple as typing ngrok HTTP 5000. This says, hey ngrok, I need an HTTP port. Um, uh, HTTP tunnel out to the internet that is serving what is available on my local host at port 5000. So when I click it, or when I hit enter, boom, I'm done. And here I get an HTTP uh, URL and I get an HTTPS. Uh, and of course we'll need the HTTPS later. So uh, for NGROC, we are now installed. We are ready to go. As soon as we start something up on port 8000, or port 5000, we will have access to it through the internet from our LARN instance.